community in Costa Mesa and um, so three years that you've been here that you've submitted work what keeps you wanting to come back to this event just to get my work out there and to have it seen by the public is really lovely and it's just a great great event it's very well done it's very organized um, it's very professional as a person that's not an artist I am just amazed and how much art there is out there. Yeah, like uh, some of my friends are showing here. They're photographers, they're ceramicists, fiber arts, all types of media. So it's a really great chance for us all to get together and support each other. I want to talk about your painting, that one because I saw it earlier and I just love the colors and the shapes and tell us a little bit about it. Well, my paintings are very organic. I don't come in with any preconceived ideas. I start all my paintings by, with my hands and then I develop them and uh, as I see things in the painting, I pull things in and out. So I try to stay true to the energetics of the painting and I, try to balance the color and the form and bring out what makes sense to me as an artist. I've been an architect in Orange County for the last 34 years, but uh, I feel that my, my art is now becoming more prominent in terms of what I'm doing. And it's funny that you say that you're an architect because in a way, I see it in your work and the shapes and, and where you put everything and how organized, and it's very organized and just it's very um, pleasing to the eye. And tell us, uh, what medium did you use for it? Uh, I paint in acrylic, but I often use some pencil. I may use some oil pastel, uh, but it's pretty much acrylic. And it can be on any surface. It can be on raw canvas, stretch canvas, maybe plywood, paper. It kind of looked like a lot of eyes in a way. Is, a, is there a story behind the, or that? I don't know, maybe I saw something different. Or <laughs> well, sometimes I make stamps out of linoleum and I, and I make patterns with those stamps. So sometimes they become eyes, sometimes they become faces, sometimes they become abstract patterns. It depends. All right, well, yeah. congratulations again. And Thank you. Truly, you truly deserve it.